guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Okay, today we're building um, <laughs> the three roommates from yesterday's apartment. In case you didn't see that, I put up a cast video of three roommates uh, yesterday, so check that out if you want to know who those girls are. I'm not gonna do a let's play of it, I just felt like doing something that kind of fit together for once. So, and also, I haven't done any apartments in a while, so. Uh, if you like, I, I do have a few coming up, um, just so you guys know, but if you want me to continue making apartments, I can totally do that. Leave a comment in the comment section below um, if you got any suggestions for apartments. I have a pastel apartment incoming, I have a YouTuber apartment, and I have a big family apartment as well. And yeah, but if you want anything else, let me know, because I am totally up for building apartments. It's very much, it's very fun. Um, Personally, I am much more of an apartment person than a house person, so it also fits me. Like, if I was to do a dream house or something, I probably wouldn't do a dream house. I would probably do a dream apartment. But anyways, so we're doing this apartment or building this apartment for the three girls from yesterday. And I know it looks very expensive, but imagine that Jackie has inherited this apartment from her dad, um, who is a very successful businessman. Uh, Jackie herself is an athletic person. <laughs> Ath uh, what's it called? Athlet uh, a sports person. <laughs> I don't know what they're called. Oh no. Um, <laughs> but yeah, she does that. So, but she uh, she inherited this or she got this apartment from her dad. So, and Jackie is sorry. No, Jackie, Pamela and Faye are her friends and they live here together, but they all got different styles. However, Jackie's room fits the whole aesthetic of this apartment much better than the other two. Like, um, Pamela, who's the musician, has a lot more of a boho, not boho, but yeah, maybe boho. Very colorful style. And Faye, who is a children's book writer, has a lot more of a cute style like it's very pink and blue and stuff like that so yes and she has a lot of stuff i really like her room though like i like all three girls room they're very different so you'll see that in a bit but for now we're just building the uh kitchen i've never used those counters for a kitchen before so that was fun and also i had huge problems <laughs> with those walls um i tried to make them work i end up using like a wall divider uh just to put in some kind of pattern like you'll see here just to put in some kind of pattern because I felt like the blue was just a little bit too boring and I've never used those wall divider, the, the whiters, <laughs> dividers as patterns before so I felt like that would be fun to do for once but I had a huge space in this apartment uh like there what's it called like a, the room the room here is just humongous you could probably make uh you could probably move the kitchen and then build a room for a fourth uh, roomy for <laughs> to be honest but I, I just wanted three so anyways it's not the space itself is pretty expensive but <laughs> it's built in the spice district I think it's built in uh, what's her name Jita Jita and that guy the, her son the two who always fight um <laughs> if you have if you've played in spice by spice district district you know you know what i'm talking about i have issues speaking today like any other day but you know it's gonna be fine <laughs> but yeah it's built in their apartment um obviously i evicted them because they're not supposed to live here but you know whatever <laughs> it's fine maybe they'll start i don't know fighting somewhere else it's they they get on my nerves so much anyways um <laughs> but yeah so they have like a big together room not together room but living space and i was having huge problems trying to figure out what to put there but so yeah i i put in a bubble blower and also a computer because none of the rooms themselves have computers computers in them um and then i put in possibly a bookshelf or something i don't remember i've never put in a bubble blower in a build before so that was fun for me um <laughs> i was just like yeah this is black and white we can use this <laughs> basically okay um apparently i'm starting with jackie's room first so this is going to be the modern one she is um jackie is a tougher girl but she's uh, apparently we're going back to the living room i don't know <laughs> okay but she is uh she's a tougher girl she's a sports chick she is what what's it called um sports star not sports star she just works in the athletic uh career there we go <laughs> perfect explanation for you guys you're welcome um 
Uh, but yeah, so her room is very min minimalistic, it's very modern and stuff like that. But you'll see that once it gets started. For now, I'm just still just trying to fill out this entire space, this huge space down here. Um, I didn't want the, the TV area to go past that first door into Jackie's room, so uh, they end up with like a huge space here. And also I couldn't make that work because it was just, it didn't look right. So, uh, I mean the table, football table, 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 football table, t t the table. <laughs> What? I don't know what it's called. <laughs> I asked in one of my previous builds, but this is pre-recorded because I am currently in Denmark. I think. I'm pretty sure. Or I'm on my way home or something. S something like that. So um, I haven't seen any comments on any prior videos for now. I do like like uh, answering all of them. I really like reading and answering comments. So leave a comment. Say hi. If you're if you're listening to this, say hi. Just say hi. Say hi, Rosa. That would make me very happy. <laughs> I'm possibly in pain right now, so <laughs> I have this tooth problem that I need to have fixed while I'm in Denmark. So I might just be lying in a bed crying right now. Who knows? Nobody knows. We'll see when the time comes. <laughs> I'm I'm scared, guys. Okay, anyways. So we're just building, filling out this. It annoys me right now when I'm rewatching it, but that table is not aligned with the wall. That's bothering me a lot. I've never used that poster before, so I felt like I wanted to use that one. And now we're going into the sports chick's room. And it's very minimalistic. She has a TV, if I'm not mistaken. Of course, she has a bit of a more expensive style. Like her parents are rich. Her, ma her man, <laughs> her dad is a successful businessman. So he has a lot of money and she definitely inherited some of that. She has a very good trust fund. <laughs> so her whole room is maybe a little bit more expensive looking and modern than the other two girls. But that's completely fine. By the way, if you download this, you can totally do whatever you want with it. I mean, it doesn't make any sense to do it with apartment builds because it's apartments built builds. Like, there's not much to the exterior, but if you download this, you you like the floor plan, <laughs> you, can st you can get it for that and just do whatever you want with the rooms. Or if there's something in the room that you don't like, you can do that. I put it up on the gallery. I've deleted the doors. Um, so everything in what is one room, but you can just put up a wall again I believe that I fixed it so that I've got BB move objects on and the doors aren't actually gone um, Just just the wall like where the door is so everything is in one room. You can just place it down um, And remember it's in Jita and that other guy. I don't remember the name of uh, his Apartment in Spice District. That's where you have to place it anyways. Yeah, so I put in that uh, What's it called? Oh, no Bud, what's it called? That runner thing. <laughs> and also a boxing thing. <laughs> My English today is amazing. Don't you guys think so? Um, <laughs> I don't. I, if I hurt myself right now, I wouldn't know what I was talking about, but. <laughs> um, the run, What's it called? I know what they're called. Uh, runner. Run, just, dang it. Okay, moving on. Just putting some more clutter outside or plants and plants because we can't get enough. I like putting those on the on the bookshelves. It just looks more lived in, basically. So, and I felt like the whole area was a little bit too dark, so I put some lamps. My voice is really weird right now. I'm sorry. I've been talking too much. <laughs> Anyways, this is uh, Pamela's room, so the mus musician's room, and I really like it. It's colorful. I use like a garage door as the background, um, which I've done in uh, probably haven't done before actually. No. But yeah, I really like how that turned out. I don't know how she got that garage door in there, but you know, that's just details. Maybe it was in there already. Who knows? Maybe they had used to have a garage on uh, the third floor of this apartment. Who knows? I, I, I don't know. <laughs> uh, and also, I'm pretty sure I placed those radiators in every single room in this build because why not? I mean, it just gives it just gives it a more realistic look to me. Um, I don't know, and they're they're cute. I like them. <laughs> they're from the Vampire Game Pack, in case you did not know. And yeah, so other than that, we're just placing down some wardrobes and just making it all. I'm pretty sure I put some um, extra walls there as well. I'm, I think she has a brick wall. I like brick walls. I've had this thing for Brooklyn apartments since I was 13 or 14. Um, it's been my my dream to live in one, but obviously that's not gonna happen because. 
I'm not much for moving to the US right now, so <laughs> uh, let's not get into politics anyways. Um, but yeah, so I'm pretty sure I placed down a brick wall uh, somewhere here and make it a little bit darker. It's a little bit too light for my liking right now. Um, I didn't want her, yeah, see, I didn't want her room to be too bright. I want it to be cozy, so it's just not, not too much light. But I do make the, the walls like a red, I think. I think I used one of the ones, one of the wallpapers from the Vampire Game Pack, who has like a, who? <laughs> it has like a, it's funny because when you're face on it, like looking straight at it, you can't actually see there's a print on it, but then when you turn your camera around, there's this little detail on it. I really like it, like it's very cool. Uh, they did like that. You have another swatch in the same color where they, uh, it has the pattern all, all the time, but this one is just very cool. I use that one, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I yeah, there you go. I'm pretty sure. And then a brick wall. Aha! Nailed it. Anyways. <laughs> um, but yeah, so are we going into phase room in a second, I think. I really like that wall as well. I don't know. I like a lot of the brick walls here in the game. I just like it. And I'm I use that pink bed to the left. I've never used that one before. Um, as far as I remember. I've always felt like it was a bit too much for me, but for this one I wanted it I wanted to dress it down. So, does that make any sense? Like, you can wear a pair of really expensive shoes and then wear some clothes from H&M to dress the shoes down. I was trying to do that with the wall. <laughs> no, not the wall, the bed, but may not have, have succeeded. I'm pretty sure I used the wall from the Glamour, gla Glamour, Glamour pack, Glamour stuff pack? Glamour stuff, I, I don't know what it's called. That, that one. Um, which I'm pretty sure I haven't used before either. I probably have, I just don't remember, but I just, yeah, whatever. If I have, um, my apologies, but I don't think I have. And I use, I know it looks weird, but it works fine. Those two placed on top of each other. I don't, I just, just like that it looked a bit different. So it wasn't just two mirrors right next to each other. So yes, and she has a very cute room overall. A lot of fairy lights, a lot of small um, figurines or models here and there. And um, I'm pretty sure it plays like a teddy, not a teddy, but... The, the bunny one in here as well, even though she can't actually use it, just to have it there just because it was cute. <laughs> um, so yeah, just trying to make, give these three rooms pers different personalities basically, because I really like doing that. I think it's a lot of fun. So yes, <clears throat> sorry, I, I often don't use those. I mean, I have a problem with silver and gold combined. I don't know, my sister told me something when I was a kid, like, you should not wear golden earrings with silver bracelets or something like that. And it's stuck with me ever since. Even though I've seen people pull it off, like, it looked good. <laughs> but I just can't. I just, my, it's, it's one of those things you get told when you're, ki you're a kid and then you can't forget it afterwards. And it just bothers me. Why did you have to tell me that? <laughs> I don't know. So I tried to ignore that with the the curtains um, next to the curtains framing the, the, the mirrors and then the background on the bed because those are silver but the curtains have this like gold golden band and also the pole or whatever it's called above uh, the ones that hold the curtains is golden as well so I just try to ignore it <laughs> basically um, but yeah <laughs> she has a lot of like it's it's a very bright room compared to the other one um, compared to Pamela's room they're quite opposites I think uh, and also it's very cluttered. She's got a lot of makeup in there and a lot of mirrors as well But I felt like it fit. I, f I felt like it fit. Yeah. Also, I used one of those um, I think they're from Might be from City Living. They might also be from the restaurant thing. I'm not actually just dine out It's like a thing that hangs on the wall but it's not a painting or a drawing or anything. That bunny has the cutest swatch, that one. I did not know until I saw a picture on, t on Tumblr. It, it, I just, I was mind blown. It's so cute <laughs> with the spots in different colors. I really like it. Um, I'm gonna talk about this thing, by the way. I put it up in a second. That one, what's that called? I don't know what it's called. I need to know all these things. Teach me. Someone teach me. <laughs> also, I get like these comments now and then. <laughs> Someone <laughs> has listened through the entire thing and then read, read a comment like, "This is how you say it." Thank you. If I'm if I'm asking, how do I say that? I genuinely mean like, tell me because I don't know. So it helps me a lot. <laughs> to be honest, I like 
I like languages. I like learning languages, um, which is why I can read several languages actually. But I like I like languages. So if you got any corrections, not like mean corrections, but just if I'm asking and stuff like that, just feel free to leave a comment. It I, it's actually appreciated. Anyways, uh, we're going into screenshots in just a second. So I do hope you enjoyed this apartment renovation. You can download it off the gallery. My ID is the same as my YouTube name, so Evident Sims. And I do hope you enjoyed this video. Feel free to like and subscribe and all that. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.